Hey guys, I'm Cheryl Burke. And I'm Matthew Lawrence. And we're getting, getting married. married. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Friends, as a sign of your love and support, I ask you all now to quiet your minds and hearts as they embark on this next chapter of their lives as husband and wife. So this is back in the day, season three. Season three, yeah. And uh, but my brother did the tour afterwards. So I joined Joe on his bus for the first like leg. They started out um, on the west coast here, and then at the Staples Center, uh, I was in the back, you know, I think it was section. Like family and friends. Yeah, was, that's what it was. Friends, yeah. Family and friends, and I was back, by, like you know, behind the Staples Center where all the buses were, and I was talking to Joe's dance partner and her husband. Then all of a sudden, this like little thing keeps like. Popping her head up, with, she's like, in no her makeup on. robe. I just showered. And like flip flops or like sandals, whatever they were, and like, and she's like, kind of like going like this. And I remember that kind of everything else just sort of faded away. And I'm I was short. like, I gotta know, I gotta know who this this person is who keeps jumping up and down and trying to see what's going on over here. But then I figured, you know, if this guy thinks I'm cute after a performance with like all the makeup off and like sweaty and really short and stocky, then we're good to go. <laughs> Well, my father passed away. Um, that would be 2018. In, in March. March. Yes, yeah. that was a crazy day. Um, and yeah, it was. So, like, my whole life just like paused for a second. That was like a roller coaster ride of emotions because yeah. it was not expected at all. So then it was hard to celebrate my birthday, right? Because it's hard to put on like that face and like, oh, okay, what do you want to do? I'm like, I haven't really been thinking about it to be honest. But then. You yeah. took me to the montage, yeah. right? So we get there and it's like, it's six, six, five, six o'clock and he's like, jump in the shower. And I'm like, first of all, it never comes out of his mouth, jump in the <laughs> shower. Like, um, and then he's like, and hurry up. I'm like, you can't, first of all, I hate it when people do that to me. Don't rush me. You know, it's my birthday. I'm not gonna hurry up and do anything. And yeah. then I came out of the shower and I got ready. And then there was this like beautiful setting of flowers and this little note. So I sat down and then he was like, open it. And then there was this little fine, like, I could not see it. I have really bad eyes. So, like, here I am like this, yeah. right? Like, touching my nose. And I was like... And I'm like, cross-eyed. <laughs> yeah. And then I turn to Matt. I'm like, Matt, what is this? This is ridiculous. And he's on one knee. Yeah. And he proposed. And it was very emotional. Mm. And my I just... Glasses are fogging yeah. up. <laughs> is that kind of emotional or hot? Yeah, but, you know, just, it's a, yeah, it's, it's a good story. It's a great, great story. Great story. It's a great story. <laughs> I have always been a huge fan of Ramona Cabeza, and she was actually very excited to not only do my dress, but do the whole wedding party. Ramona has been so amazing to work with, and I just felt sorry for anyone that had to work with me. <laughs> because like, doing, coming from Dancing with the Stars, and like, who knows how many dresses I've actually had made for me, that like, I think that I know, but like, I actually don't. I have no idea. I'm such a huge fan, by the way. I've always been, so thank you. This has been an honor, really. She wasn't like stuck on just what she wanted. She was willing to work with me. And so I think that um, it's going to be gorgeous. The ceremony dress is, um, we have a sweetheart neck, and then we've got like a cap sleeve. Actually, it's her line coming out in 2020. So I'm the first person to wear it, um, the bodice part of it. And then we have, um, it's like a corset. And then we've got a skirt that goes into a train. Um, it's about six feet long. And then the veil is going to be longer than the train. Yeah, there's gonna be lots of people stepping on it, I'm sure. But what I love the most is the detailing of the buttons that go down from my back all the way to the end of the skirt, and it's gonna be um, rhinestone. I like everything like pretty sleek and simple, but effective, <laughs> you know? So like to still have like the drama of the dress, but then still be able to see the shape of my body. I just want it to look classic so that one day when my kids see these photos, they're not gonna be like, mom, what is that? What did you wear? Well, the reception dress is, um, it still has that same like shape with, with a cap sleeve and then they, it's lace. So it looks like I'm naked underneath, but it's obviously not it's lining, but it's lace throughout. And it's basically the same type of cut, but a different material. And also have, has buttons on the back with the rhinestones and stuff like that. It's very like sleek, but like more edgy, I would say for the reception.
actually getting married at the Fairmont Grand Del Mar. It's beautiful. It's, really it's actually pretty. gorgeous. Our wedding is going to be outdoors, so yeah, it's going to be Yeah, the really one pretty. you went to was... It was, in, it was like a church, but Cheryl church. doesn't so like ballrooms, which I understand them. because she's lived in them her whole life. I'm she didn't want to get married. Ballroom. Yeah, she didn't want to get married in a ballroom. So yeah. that was the big, that was like Cheryl's one big thing. So, yeah. so it's outdoors, it's really going to be pretty. we're getting really creative. Like, yeah. it's costly, but we're getting very creative. <laughs> We're trying not to make it like classic wedding food. Like we kind of wanted um, family style. We start with this pear salad, right? Yeah, the salad's amazing. The, the salad food at this place so is incredible. Good. We've got the uh, sea bass. The sea bass, the, the um, with the miso glaze over the. Oh, so, so good. Yummy. Really good. And then we've got uh, the rib, short rib. Oh, the short rib. Yeah. And then Which the just risotto. falls apart in your mouth. Um, the risotto. And then, and then a bunch of different sides so and good. vegetables. Yeah. This is the biggest tier. So think about your favorite flavor maybe for the biggest tier. The cake Ooh. got six. I added another tier, babe. Really? <laughs> yeah. We got six now? Yep. Now we got six. Why don't we go seven? <laughs> Just make it a lucky number. You can make that phone call. Okay. So we've got different flavors. Yeah, different they're all different tiers. flavors, yeah. We have, what's the main one? The main one is... Confetti. No, uh, that, that's the top. That's the top one? Yeah. Um, did we do the vanilla and, or, we and strawberry? We did the vanilla, yes, we did that one. Van no, not strawberry. Berries, oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, vanilla and, berries. And there's chocolate. And then you have the chocolate one. And then there was marble? Mm-hmm. With like caramelized yeah. like candies? Yeah, but then my favorite's the confetti. Yeah, yours is the confetti, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. We're getting married on top of a fountain, so we're flooring a fountain. Yeah. Their their main fountain that people like always get. They get married there, but they get normally in married in the arch. Yeah. Yeah. But we're actually, the wedding party will be meeting in the arch, and then they're building um, a dance floor to lay over the fountain and stairs. So we're actually on top of a fountain for this. Yes. And this is the first for the hotel. For the ceremony, um, we're having an empty chair for my dad. So it's gonna have like a picture frame that says in memory of just for the ceremony. Um, and He's walking then you down the aisle. My stepdad. Yeah. Stepdad will be mm -hmm. walking me down. Vows are written, like I could write a novel, but we're trying to, we're also on a time limit for our ceremony. We don't be able to get bored. Can't say it all. No, can't say it no. all. But um, I definitely have mine done. Are yours done? For 80%. We have um, a priest mm -hmm. on Cheryl's side from the Catholic, Catholic side and two ministers from the Protestant side. And the ministers are my great uncles. And they baptized me when I was they're eight twins, months right? old. And they're twins, yeah. So I've known them, yeah, yeah my whole life. I just yeah. wonder how we, we're all gonna fit on that fountain, but we'll figure it out. So the reception's in the tent. The after party, we have to move inside. So we're using really, one of their nicer, like, rooms. It's Not a, a really cool room. room. Yeah. Really cool, it's got a stage, it's really cool. It's and my little brother and his band are playing yes. at the uh, reception. Yeah. Oh, and then we also have a girl, Candace. I mean, oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. For you. Amazing French. vocalist. She's amazing. Yep. She sings one of my favorite songs. So she's going to be, that's our intro into the first dance. Any of your other co stars <clears throat> going to be at the wedding? or? Oh, yeah, everybody. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, you invite one, you got to invite them all. So that's what I did. So and much I come from two, when I come from two different dancing. generations, oh, right? Gosh. So I've got like the OG group, then I've got the new, newer pros, you know? So I've invited them so all, and I just I don't know if all of them are coming, but most of them are. Yeah. Really? Oh my. God. Yep. Well, I'm not choreographing it myself because I'm trying to avoid any tension. I don't know, like if people see me on Dancing with Stars, I'm pretty tough. You need to grab me, so, and I don't want it, like him to see that side or to experience it necessarily. I've already seen. So I've got like. Already experienced. I've got. <laughs> we've got like. It's okay. And we are gonna be using. In my head, it looks great, right? It always does. But like, we're gonna use the like the entrance and the stairs as part of like the whole dance. You kill a little gonna, time. Yeah, we're just trying to kill some. That's a long song. So. Yeah. But then we're also gonna have like him dance with his mom, and my dad's gonna dance with me, and then we're gonna do it all in one. It'll just be classy. I'm gonna do my my very best to uh, you know keep up, but I really have no dance experience, so it's it's uh, yeah. He's it's a tough. concert dancer. I am changing my name, but I think for like Dancing with the Stars, you know, we're gonna keep it the same. But um, legally, I will be uh, actually it's a Mignona. That's yeah. his real last name. Yeah, my real last so, name isn't Lawrence. Yeah, it's been a really crazy year, but it's been yeah. fun and it's great. But we just we're very private people, and we like to just I mean, you're in our home, and this is where we stay most of the time, and 
We don't yeah. really need much else, no. actually. No, I'm really looking forward to it. I mean, the honeymoon especially, but then just getting yeah. back and, like, and just getting back there, to our like, normal life. Like, right. we haven't had a normal life in yeah. months I haven't looked and at months. You. I haven't looked at you in for months. Yeah, we barely even see each other. It's true, though. <laughs> I barely see her now. It's, like, so stressful. So I'm excited for that just to be yeah. back to normal.